A roller coaster car is on a track that forms a circular loop in the vertical plane. If the car is just to maintain contact with the track at the top of the loop, what is the minimum value for its centripetal acceleration at this point? So if we're going in a loop around here, we want to know what is the minimum value for our centripetal acceleration. So here's the center of our circle. So when the cart is at the top of the track, we're just maintaining the circular motion. So there is no normal force acting on our object. So we have the weight pulling down, and we have the accelerate, our centripetal acceleration, the net acceleration, pointing downward. With that being said, the normal force is equal to zero. So if we apply Newton's second law, we have the net force is equal to ma centripetal. But f is the sum of all forces, and if we consider it down to be the positive direction, we would have fn plus mg is equal to ma centripetal, as we stated, we're just maintaining contact. So our normal force is equal to zero. So we can ignore that term, which leaves us with mg is equal to ma centripetal. Now, if we divide both sides by m, this will show us that our centripetal acceleration has to be equal to the acceleration due to gravity. So our answer is a g downward because our acceleration is pointing downward, so it's in the direction of our g, so it's in the, the positive direction in our case, because we chose our axis positive to be down. So we want an acceleration down because it's going to it's the center of the circle. An answer choice of, say, c would not make any sense when we're at the top here, because having a centripetal acceleration pointing away from the center has nothing to do with an actual centripetal acceleration. So this answer doesn't make any sense, just like answer choice D doesn't make any sense. So from the beginning, you could have narrowed it down to A or B because you understand that the centripetal acceleration must be pointing downward. But after we do the algebra here, we see that our answer is A. The centripetal acceleration is G directed downward.